Hello, a very good evening to you. I'm Joe Kent with the News Now here in the South. A dairy farm in Hampshire has announced it's to start selling its own milk independently in order to survive. Jenny and Mark Stevens from Whitchurch say despite supermarkets agreeing last week to pay more to producers, they can't break even. It comes after a mass protest by dairy farmers at a supermarket in Dorset. Edward Salt reports. On their farm in North Hampshire, Mark and Jenny Stevens open their doors to the public to show them what it's like to be a dairy farmer. But there's a real serious message behind today's open day. The Stevens family say they can't break even from the profits they get from the supermarkets, so are having to diversify instead. Because of the current milk price, which is as it stands at 22.8p a litre, we're currently being paid. Statistically, you need to sell at 29p a litre to break even. So obviously, this is not sustainable, even in the short term, really. So to combat that, they've bought this vending machine to sell the milk from their farm direct to the public at the touch of a button. But why should consumers come here rather than go to the supermarket? It is a very difficult economic climate at the moment for dairy farming. So this selling some raw milk direct to the public will hopefully help um, address that in some way. Last week, farmers in Dorset took their protest against the low price of milk to this Asda store in Poole. The supermarket chain has now announced it will increase the price it pays to milk suppliers. Farmers like the Stevens say with an ongoing price war with the supermarkets, it means diversification is essential. They expect more farmers to follow in their footsteps just to make ends meet. Edward Salt, BBC South Today in Whitchurch in North Hampshire.